Our next volunteer, Stepanka Pechakova, had to get used to really extreme climate conditions in Mongolia, but she learned that five layers of clothing helped her breathe minus 40 centigrade. I was born and raised in a small Czech town, and I didn't know anything about volunteering until I entered the university. Since then, volunteering took me from a small country in the middle of Europe to Mongolia. Being a volunteer gave me so much, but, and I could go on and on about what volunteering gave me, but one thing that I value the most is the opportunity to meet amazing people, especially women. Uh, in Mongolia, I met a woman named Bere. Uh, she's in her 30s, she has a husband, now she has three kids, and she lives in Ulaanbaatar. At the time I met her, she just came back home from Australia. Seeing how Australia does well in waste management, she wanted to bring that back to her home country. So she decided to teach young Mongolians and their parents about the importance of uh, recycling and importance of environment, environment protection. While pregnant with her third child, she started an environmental NGO. She created a network of volunteers, mentors, who ta taught other kids. Uh, she not only engaged uh, schools and their directors, but also local government representatives. And on top of that, she created a mobile library. Those are the women that inspire me. Those are the women that show me, uh, like Barrett, that you can trans how to transform words into action and how to become a better person through volunteering. I've become a better person myself. And yes, I've gave, given a lot as a volunteer, but I think that I've received back so much more.